If you're interested in what students are going to see when they do the initial knowledge check, you can go to your class, go to class administration, click student view, and this will run you through exactly what the student experience will be when they get on to do the initial knowledge check. Kids can flip to Spanish with the click of a button. I'm going to skip this little tutorial because I already know what I'm doing, but students can do it. So like, put in 14, X out of it, undo, all these different things. So I'm going to get into the initial knowledge check. It will make sure that I know how to draw a line. Again, I'm going to skip the tutorial. So, you can start the knowledge check and you'll be able to see what kinds of problems the students are going to get. So, some algebraic based stuff. Um, students can click. I'm having trouble clicking because this thing's like. There we go. I don't know if they really legit don't know how to do it, but like you'll see some of these things students should be able to do. Students will not have the option to skip the knowledge check, I don't think, but we'll see. See if I can get to the actual geometry question. Yep. So there'll be some stuff in here, like those three things most of them should be able to do. Students will not be able to do the geometry stuff, obviously, unless it's something that we've taught them. So more solving equations, that kind of thing. So if you're interested in seeing what students will get tomorrow, you can get on and do the initial knowledge check yourself. It'll be about 20 questions long.